So I have some thoughts on acceptance. Check out the old 57. This acceptance factor, grace, being known and accepted and participating one with another, certainly from God, but then one again, one, one, once again, one another. Um, when I was so badly injured, I could barely walk. My legs were still had open wounds. It was a car like that 57. I was on my bicycle in the lowest gear, just riding around town for the first time. And a car like that passed me. And I swear it was a little old lady idling in first gear. And she passed me. I remember it was near Lubbock High. You know, Buddy Holly. Being accepted, you know, I actually went to see somebody just so I could get their approval. Somebody that uh, meant something to me on that ride. We go through moods and we seem to be a naturally pessimistic race. Um, there's a lot, there's a, an abundance in this world and we do well to keep working with and for one another and for our own good imagination the goals and dreams that have come up. But accepting one another and being accepted and knowing that, the uh, inner conversation sometimes is confusing. Other people's words, the time is wrong, the timing, uh, the words are incomplete. Our own thoughts can be incomplete. The living word is complete, but it takes a while to download enough of the living word, the spirit of the living God to heal and break all those, uh, bro to break loose all those um, maladjusted, scarred places and put them back in, in a good order. Right thought, right words. Keep working on it. You're going to make it because overall, since God has made his way to accept us, we can accept one another inside and out. You know, get let the thoughts come, the living word from within and make everything a good structure again. It'll, it'll be your encouragement in some of those tough times.